Hi everyone, how are you doing? So, as I was doing some Mary Kondo yesterday, I pulled out quite a bit, quite a bit of Gucci items yesterday. To the point that I felt kind of embarrassed in front of my husband. And that's why in today's video, I want to share my entire Gucci collection. I will start with some ready to wear, whatever I can find in this house anyway. To some bags, shoes, jewelry, and some items that you can't even find in the stores. So keep on watching. My first piece of designer clothing, I would say is this silk shirt right here. That's the bag and that's the front. I love the retro vibe. It might look a bit on the hanger, but let me show you in an outfit and then you can judge. So this is how I would normally wear it um, and I would pair it with a bag like this. Just an elevated version of an everyday outfit. Zoom meetings, physical meetings, errands, date nights, lunch date, so on. And in the colder season, I will pair it with a, let's say, brown blazer. Something like that. So yeah. And if I want something more cash, I would just go for something like this. Although, I'm not sure graphic tea is still my thing, so I might sell it. And I used to pair it with skirts like this too. And again, I'm not too sure about that anymore. So, sell or keep? Sell or keep? Hmm, let me know. And this guy right here, Besides being a swimsuit, I also treat it like a bodysuit so it goes really well with a pair of jeans and this blazer right here too. So cool to have. Any kind of one-piece swimsuit is a good to have for me anyway. And, and this pair of Gucci pants right here, you've probably seen me wear quite a bit on social media. Otherwise, on my last video. So this is from a Korean e-commerce called resourceunknown.com and I really like the shape of it. And the pants are from Gucci. And oh my god, I want to rave about the Gucci tailoring. Like whether it's the blazer or the pants, like the tailoring, the fit is always like top notch. And I'm just so surprised by how versatile this green pants is. Like I paired with this blazer right here for my first Milan fashion week. So many great memories. And I can't decide which is my favorite Gucci blazer because Gucci, oh my God, the tailoring, the attention to detail, the craft, really worth the investment. So that was fun. Now let's talk about the bags I have. Like this is honestly my favorite. Would I say this is my favorite? Actually, I love all of them. Like there's a few collection of Gucci there has a lot of oriental inspiration and I love it a lot. I wish I can collect a lot more of them before they were gone. But this is the piece that I managed to get hold of in 2017. Like the embroidery and the oriental embellishment over here. But it is so beautiful. I can so relate to it. And I'm not sure you can see it. Look at the embroidery right here and this detail right here that is so intricate and beautiful. So gorgeous. Like such a vibe. If I want a simpler option, there we go. We have the newest Gucci Diana which I received as a gift 
from the marketing team and I'm very grateful. If you want to watch the unboxing or styling video of this cute little bag, you, I will link it right here or right here. This is actually very versatile. This is, I wear this pretty much every day because Oh, like if you can tell the sheen the material is quite water resistant and therefore quite durable and that's why I love it I love it like see how it goes well in summer as well as in winter so I love it I really love it like it's just so versatile oh my back so yeah, this is so versatile, like I just love it. It just goes with everything. And this was my birthday gift from them last year. I am so grateful. And this one, I have lots of memories with this bag. I bought it in 2018 in the Gucci store at the Milan Galleria building. I bought this because I want something to match this blazer i wore this look to the gucci fashion show the very last one i had before the pandemic hopefully international travel will resume soon and for those who like a good vanity case look how beautiful is this look at this gold hardware and when you open it the inside the interior is like that beautiful emerald green oh love a good vanity case now let's move on to shoes shoes wise i actually don't have a lot of gucci shoes I sold at least three pairs already and I only have these left so that is these ones if you see this packaging that means it's ancient it's before the era of Alessandro Michele and I'm not sure if you remember this design but this is snake skin I bought this in either 2015 or 16 just couldn't sell it this is my first 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 gucci item that i ever had i just love that green like this green is just so sick so i'm gonna keep it until i find a way to dress it in a more modern way until then it will stay in this box but i'm obsessed with this color i just can't i just can't sell it and the other shoes i have left are these ones look at the detail gucci and their detail oh my god it's a shame that i have ruined it if i knew it earlier i would put a gel sole before walking on it but oh well how pretty it is though look at the bottom look at this detail and look at this like I just love that Mary Antoinette kind of vibe. So I'm keeping this. Mm. Now let's talk about jewelry. This case is something that you can't find in store. It is from a Gucci mooncake box that I got given by them. Look how pretty it is. So I received this, I think in 2000, 19 so the mooncake looks like like this i'll show you i think I, this is the only one i have left i just keep it for memories and then i'm preserve it for not gonna eat it anymore but it's just for decoration and for memories this is the gucci mooncake this is like my museum piece I'm gonna keep it until it turned green I'm so gross. So inside this box, you can tell. So this is 
the only mooncake I have left. And those are the rings I have left. I have two, so I have this, I have this. I just like to collect statement rings like this. And then the first drawer, we have more. We have this guy right here. Like good for like a party, like a date night. Like, I just love it. And this cutie. So pretty, isn't it? Like I really love the Gucci jewelry from that period. And also, also this one, I found it in Dubai. Um, my ex-boyfriend picked it up as a joke. Like, oh, look at how hideous this is. I was like, no, nope, I'm buying it. Like this is a knuckle Gucci knuckle duster. See how cool that is. I'm loving it. Like it was, I think, thousand three hundred dollars if not mistaken but i don't care i want it oh the last drawer i should show you what what is this so this is an incense the gucci bunny and this is the incense so yeah this is on the last drawer so that is my jewelry box oh this one this is from the last Mooncake Festival, the Gucci Mooncake. So this is where you twist, twist. And then... Isn't that cute? So these are the Gucci Mooncakes. I'm not sure if I finished them, but again, I'm just gonna keep them until they turn into a fossil again. Can you see how cool is that? Maybe I'll keep this for my children one day. So that's that. And what? Oh, oh, you know what? Remember that period that Gucci designed a lot of clothing and sunglasses for Elton John? I got one of them. Okay, so this is the reverse cat eye sunglasses. I am weird like that, but I hope you love me for who I am. Don't know where I'm gonna wear them, but I wanna. So yeah, a lot of time I keep all these things not because of the monetary value, but more of the sentimental one. Oh. This one. This one you can't get in the store as well. This is the Gucci red envelope that they sent me a couple weeks ago. How badass is that? And look at that. And last but not least, if you want something, some accessories to elevate your outfits but you don't want to spend too much i feel that stockings and leggings are the best honestly like for example these ones like look okay not sure can you see the gucci band waistband and then like so when you put them on imagine how sexy your legs look I have two pairs just in case I rip one of them. But these honestly look so good with a mini skirt or mini dress or in winter, like a shorts and blazer with boots. And then your legs just look amazing with these stockings. Like love, 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 love. And also I have another option, which is these ones and they go really well with my earthy brown coat. Like, look at that. Just take every outfit to the next level. Mwah! So yeah, these are the Gucci items that I currently have. 
that I currently remember I have. But yeah, that's just us girls. Sometimes we buy things and we forget about them and that's just who we are. Gucci is a brand that I am obsessed with. It's not for everyone, but I love that geek chic retro vibe that they have and that's why I collect so many of them. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel and remember to press the bell button so that you get notified when there's a new video coming up. Have a lovely day and I hope I will see you on my next video. Ciao!